it is so hot outside right now so we're going to escape the summer heat on this episode i'm not telling you where we're going inside but here's a little hint get your trigger finger ready in the Flatiron District, locals and tourists will expect to find restaurants, stores, and boutiques. What they won't expect to find is an indoor gun range, but that's the beauty of New York. We're headed to the West Side Rifle and Pistol Range. Most people have never seen a gun, except video games, uh, on TV, movies. Going down towards the sound of gunfire, going down here, it's it can be you know awkward. Having them relax is the best thing in all. Who comes here to shoot? Who are you finding is coming off the street? So we have memberships to cover law enforcement. Anyone having a handgun license in New York City invariably lands up here. What safety tips or tips in general do you have for people who are coming in to shoot? The most basic safety is the gun always has to be pointed in the safe direction. Always assume and always treat a gun as if it's loaded. The finger never engages the trigger until you have control of the weapon, your gun's pointing downrange direction of the targets. West Side Rifle and Pistol Range has been open since 1964. John and his team have seen shots fired by everyone, from cops to hunters to hobbyists and celebrities, including Robert De Niro, 50 Cent, and the cast of Law & Order. Okay, so the rifle you'll be using today, this is called a Ruger 77. Your safety, it has three positions all the way forward. The gun will fire your bolt to load and unload is operational. If you put the safety to the rear, the bolt's locked, the trigger's locked. If you put the safety in between the two points, your bolt's operational to load or unload, but your trigger is locked. So safety off is all the way forward, safety on is all the way to the rear. Most people when they pick up a gun, they invariably pick it up with their finger on the trigger. And oh, it's oh. very easy to accidentally fire the gun. The gun can't tell the difference. Purposely pulling the trigger, accidentally pulling the trigger. Alright, so remember, bolt forward, bolt down, safety off and fire the gun. And the sights on the gun. You have a front sight, which if you can see on the back of it, there's a small gold bead on yes. it. Yes. And your rear sight, halfway down, small white diamond. Mm -hmm. So you're centering your front sight, centering that gold bead right on top of that small white diamond. Got it. Okay. Remember, at all times, you have a loaded gun in your hand, all right? So if at any time you stop shooting, remember, finger immediately off the trigger. And again, if you decide that you've had enough, you put your safety on, put the gun on the tabletop pointing down. Now that I've learned the procedure and the safety tips, I'm ready to shoot. I've shot a gun before, but never in Manhattan. I'm ready to take aim. glory shots. I don't just shot the target, I shoot at them too. Couldn't have done without you, you my man. You are excellent. You are I think excellent. You have uh, any Oakley DNA. After shooting and getting on target, I'm seeing how fun this sport can be. No matter where you're shooting, always remember to act as if a gun is loaded. I have to say, John, that this was super relaxing. I felt very at ease and I'm just grateful that I had a great instructor to show me how it's done. It's a pleasure. Thank you so much for having me here at Westside. Here we go, people in action right now. Another one to the floor. Yep, <laughs> reporting from New York, I'm Christy Clemens.